Okay guys, welcome back to another video. As you can see, the sun's going down just behind us there. Um, it's another one of those uh, last knocking sort of got one hour to catch a fish sort of jobs. Because uh, I've been working nights, every time I have a day off, I get up late and then I don't feel like doing much. And then when it comes to the last minute of the day, I've only got an hour a lot left and we're in that predicament again. I've got a big camera in, in my bag, so um, I'll get that out for catch something or making some farty little clips in between. Uh, but today I've got my uh, light law rod and we're going to do a bit of uh, crankbait fishing and hopefully catch a few little jacks from canal. So uh, yeah, we know for, without further ado, we'll stop wasting time talking and we'll get that canal as quick as possible because it's going to get dark in about, well it's currently half past three, so that's probably about an hour, literally an hour. What a light. It's like tap water. It's that clear. Clip the net on here, so I have to carry it. Love this net. Don't weigh out either. I'm going to start with the Salmo Hornet, rattling 4.5 centimetre. It's uh, one of my favourite ones for canal. It's fairly deep diving, but if you work it properly, you're not scraping out snags and shit off the bottom. Fantastic action on it. Let's take these glasses off, it's too dark under here. Just troll it. That'd be a little purge, isn't it? Come on. One fish would be nice. Could be 12 ounce, could be 10 bad. Not really bothered. Uh, beautiful evening though. Oh, what was that? that nailed then. Ah, perch. That million roach as well. Absolutely crushed it. A bit okay. Lots of dying weed beds on the bottom. So the beauty of this law is, because it's getting cold, fish tend to be lower down. So it's a diving floating crank hit the weed bed and then you just let it float up a little bit start working it again Seen loads of bait fish topping further up. So we'll go and nail it. Weird thing is, other than the little perch. I've been seeing not one follow, nothing. Oh, so how'd it go? Yeah, pike. That's what I want. Hey. <laughs> there are little ones we're after. In it, but that's what I catch one. So they are there, look. Okay, got him. Okay, let's get one. I keep net one in there. Oh, don't spin. Let me get it. 
I don't know, there's one at the top of the head. Get it. It's a lucky boy. I'll set a big camera up and get a party shot. I'll come back fishing, man. Got a snake. Tree found. Oh, snag they go. Yeah. Oh, I've done us on the snag. Mound of leaves on bottom. Just to come up the side of it and there's a little flash. <laughs> and well, obviously a little tiny fight. Let's see if he'll come back. It's going at 10 past four. I'm nearly back at car. I've got one spot to it and then uh, hopefully it's not full of druggies that are all sparking up. Uh, might be in for a chub or a, or a perch. Okay, so we're very much at the end of the session now. It's getting really dark. Last spot was a dud. I didn't even see a perch, a roach, nothing. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> like I say, it was a very long time ago. Is it a miss to go down there and catch a chub or a perch or something? So, uh, yeah. I'll show you what that lore is now. It's a Salmo rattling hornet. You can buy them from anywhere. They're in every single retailer. So, uh, now go and catch some fish. And don't poo in the left. So, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. I like preems. <laughs>